Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Shomuz Banerjee. And in this lecture, we are going to talk about CSINET Life Science Unit 8, that is CSINET Life Science Genetics. CSINET Life Science Unit 8 or Genetics, many students fear this topic because there are mostly analytical questions asked from this topic. So basically, I am going to talk about the CSINET Life Science Unit 8 syllabus, which are more important topics, which are less important topics. We are going to discuss that. Whether there are more uh, analytical questions or more memory based questions, we are going to discuss that. And at the end, I am going to give you five most important topics from CSINET Unit 8 Genetics. So stay tuned and watch this lecture thoroughly. Let's begin to talk about the first part that is CSINET Life Science Unit 8 syllabus. And in this syllabus, we have this. This syllabus is unedited. This is exactly from CSINET website. So we have Mendelian principles. And believe me, they don't ask any question from Mendelian principles. The next one is concept of gene. That is allele, multiple allele, pseudo allele, all these concepts. You need to know this, obviously, uh, even in the plus two level. But they won't ask any question from it. Now, green color coded extensions of Mendelian principle is most important type. Green one is the most important. Yellow one is the moderately important type. Red one is the least important type. So we have extension of Mendelian principle. That is a part of non-Mendelian inheritance and co-dominance, incomplete dominance, pleiotropy, genomic imprinting, penetrance, expressivity, phenocopy, linkage, crossing over. And uh, here one more topic that is that is not present in here is very, very important. That is epistasis. All are very, very important. The next one is gene mapping methods. That is linkage map, tetrad analysis, mapping with molecular markers. CSRO asks questions from this topic every single examination, be it from linkage map, be it from tetrad analysis, be it from mapping with molecular markers, what not. They have asked plenty of questions from this topics only. So you need to learn this topic, gene mapping methods, very, very important. The next one is extra chromosomal inheritance, not that important. The inheritance of mitochondrial DNA and chloroplast DNA, maternal inheritance, not that important. Microbial genetics, that is methods of microbial gene transfer, that is horizontal gene transfer, uh, conjugation, okay, uh, transformation, transduction, very, very important. Microbial genetics, important. Moderately important. Human genetics, that is pedigree analysis, large score for linkage testing, karyotyping are there and they are moderately important. Quantitative genetics, polygenic inheritance, heritab like herit heritability and measurement with QTL mapping, not that important anymore. Earlier there were questions but not that important anymore based on previous few question papers. Mutation, molecular part of the genetics is important like mutation, type of mutation, causes deletion, mutation types and everything, a least important topic from them and structure and new numerical alteration of the chromosome so so the changes in the chromosome either in the number of the chromosomes or in the shape structure of the chromosomes are equally important numerical aberrations as well as the deletion duplication inversion translocation ploidy polyploidy aneuploidy euploidy all are super important they are belong to the they belong to the modern important topic list so these are the topic lists most important non mendel inheritance gene mapping methods and the heritability part that is a uh, uh, we have the pedigree analysis and all that is more important and then we have like microbial genetics structural numerical alteration important like pedigree analysis problems were really more important earlier but for past three four examinations they are not asking much question from pedigree even asking smaller questions so we put it into the yellow colored frame next move on to the question pattern discussion what we have here the analytical and memory and remember in unit 8 csi net genetics unit more analytical questions will be there than memory based questions and part c part b distribution again more part c questions will be asked than part b questions so it is biased towards part c biased towards analytical questions clear so this is something that that is uniquely delivered from shomu's biology to you so if you like this please hit the like button and share so before going into the next part of our discussion, there is five most important topics from this unit. Let me tell you one simple idea. If you enjoy this video, if you like this kind of knowledge, this kind of information, like who someone studies uh, the complete syllabus and give you a clear gist of that syllabus and topics so that you can prepare in the less number of uh, months, in the less amount of time to cover most of the syllabus, then you can think of joining Shomu's Biology Online Coaching Program. We have all this tailored for you. You can get this ready-made available at your disposal. 
and uh, you can get our study material you can still get some benefit from it so we have different kind of packages depending upon your requirement also depending upon uh, the affordability so you can try out any of our service either study material or our coaching services if you want to get this the link here in this in the description and also we have this number that is popping in this uh, side this is our universal number you can contact this number whatsapp this number the admission for the coaching process will continue and uh, uh, if if obviously we take the students from the admission time frame which is two to two, two and a half months and beyond that time we don't take anyone in the middle so if the admission is going on we'll definitely cater you for that session or i'll tell you to wait for the next session so you can try this out and i believe that nobody is offering two years validity with that much of price point that we are offering so you're going to get everything for two years and two years means four net examinations so it will obviously increase your chance to qualify as an examination even when you are not in touch with us so what are you waiting for if you wish to join you can always join in here now there is a bonus bonus tip for you five top five must read topics for csr net unit 8 csr net life science unit 10 and what are those topics extension of mendelian principle that is non mendelian inheritance gene mapping uh, molecular mapping or any sorts of gene tetrad analysis any parts of the mapping mutation uh, then we have microbial genetics particularly the conjugation part is very important code transduction code transformation frequencies are really important then we have chromosomal aberrations numerical aberration and structural aberrations both are equally important these are the five most important topics from unit 8 csn life science unit 8 csn life science genetics syllabus so if you like this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future thank you bye